hope you're all doing okay. Uh, my name is Anne. We have a half an hour session today. Um, please, please make sure you've warmed up before jumping into this video. Just check out our channel. We have we have a few warm ups you can choose from, and then when you're done, you can get back to this video. Um, all you're going to need is a yoga mat. If you don't have one, you just could be on the floor. That is absolutely fine. Um, Make sure you have something uh, next to you, like a blanket or a jumper or something that you could put under your knees if you need to, if it's a hard floor, that'll help you a lot. If you have a block or a book that you could use, that's also amazing. If not, don't worry too much. I'm just going to offer variations later on. Um, yeah, that's it. So when you're ready, I'm going to meet you at the top of your mats. Make sure you put your feet together. Make sure you squeeze your glutes just, just slightly. Tuck your tailbone under, engage your core. Put your hands by your side. This is our mountain pose. Palms facing forward. Stand tall, shoulders back and down, just up and forward. Keep a straight neck. And just breathe here for a second. Deep inhales and long exhales. And when you're ready on your next inhale, I'm just to raise your arms up towards the sky, look up. And as you exhale, hands from the hips to a forward fold. Keep your knees soft, make sure you feel that stretch in the back of your thighs, the hamstrings. Hands down, take a breath here. And as you exhale, place your hands on your thighs just over the knee and on your next inhale, half lift, straight legs, straight back, 90 degree angle from your hips. Again, exhale, hinge from the hips, come to the forward fold. Hands down, take a deep breath in. Back from here, you can either step or jump to a high plank. Hold it for a breath. And as you exhale, knees down, chest and chin to the floor. Make sure to keep your elbows close to your body. Don't let them open to the side. Hips down. Correct your position. Hands under your shoulders. And from here, take a deep breath in. And as you exhale, lift the chest off the mat, either to a mini cobra, just here, a full cobra, or if this is too much, you might want to try the sphinx, press your elbows down, forearms on the mat, and you should feel that stretch in the middle of your back. Just pick one, take a deep breath, and as you exhale, chest back down, hands under your shoulders, come up to your knees, Take your toes under and come up to down dog. Hips back and up. You don't have to place your heels down just to make sure your back is straight. Might want to move around here, maybe stretch one leg at a time or placing the heel down. Do whatever feels good, move your hips around. And when you're happy, just want a stable down dog. And hold it for a breath. One more. And as you exhale, start walking your feet towards your hands. You can go to forward fold again. Take a deep breath in. And as you exhale, come up to standing. Slowly, slowly. We can do this again when you're ready. Make sure your feet are together, squeeze your glutes in, tuck your tailbone under, keep your core engaged, hands by your side, mountain pose. Take a breath here. And on your next inhale, hands over your head, look up. I'm going to do a little side stretch here with your right hand to grab your left wrist. Again, inhale, feel the body lengthening, and as you exhale, stretch towards the right side, reach 
towards the right side with your left hand. Let me move so you can see what I'm doing. Right here. Beautiful work. Exhale, come back to the middle, switch arms. Now grab your right wrist with your left hand. Take a deep breath. Feel your spine lengthen in and as you exhale, reach towards the left side. Remember to breathe. And on your next exhale, come back to the middle. Hands back down. We're going to come back to the top of the mat. And from here, hands down, hinge from the hips, soft knees, forward fold. Take a breath. On your next exhale, hands on your thighs. Inhale, half lift. Exhale again, bend the knees, forward fold, plant your hands down, and from here, step or jump into high plank, hold it. As you exhale, knees down, chest and chin to the floor, elbows close to your body, hips down. Take a deep breath in, hands under your shoulders. Bend as you exhale, cobra, mini cobra, or sphinx, whatever works. On your next exhale, chest back down, tuck your toes under, come up to your knees, and hips up to down dog. Hold it, find a stable position. Again, your heels don't have to be on the floor. Keep your knees soft as long as your back is straight. Remember, shoulders away from the ears. Couple more breaths. And on your next exhale, start walking your feet towards your hands until we come to the top of our mats. Stay here for a second, you might want to cross your elbows. Always keep your knees soft to protect your hamstrings and your lower back. If this doesn't feel good, maybe bend your knees even more. Just cross your elbows, let go of your upper body, let your weight just go. Relax the neck. One more breath. As you exhale, hands back down, hinge from the hips and come up to standing. Beautiful work. One more time. Good pick up the pace. Make it a bit harder. So when you're ready, hands up, look up towards the sky. Exhale, hands back down, reach from the hips, forward fold, plant your hands down, from here step or jump to plank, hold it for a second, as you exhale, knees down, chest and chin to the floor, hips down, hands under the shoulders, cobra, or mini cobra, or sphinx. Take a big breath, look up, and as you exhale, chest back down, Tuck your toes under, come up to your knees, and from here down dog. Beautiful work. And hold it on a stable down dog. Three breaths here. It's gonna be hard if you're tired, if your shoulders are hurting. Just get into a child's pose for a second. We're here. You can get into child's pose whenever you need to. This is a resting pose. But if you're happy, stay down, dog. One more breath. And you exhale. Start walking towards your hands. In a forward fold here. Relax for a second. Let go of your upper body. Cross your elbows. Keep your knees soft and bent. Beautiful work. Hands back down and slowly come up to standing. Vertebra, vertebra. 
beautiful work. We're going to change our vinyasa now. Again, we're going to stay at the top of our mats. Feet together, mountain pose, squeeze your glutes, core engaged. Hands by your side, take a deep breath in. Comes over your head, look up. And from here, we're going to get into a chair. So bring your hips back, use your quads, use your glutes properly. Push your hips back, make sure you can see your toes. Your knees are not way over your toes. Put your hands over your head, hold it. And just breathe. Beautiful. From here, put your hands together, palms together, and bring them in front of your heart. Beautiful work. Exhale, hands down, we're in forward fold now. Hold it here for a minute. Take a deep breath in. As you exhale, place your hands on your thighs. And the inhale, half lift again, 90 degrees on your hips, straight back, straight legs, exhale, go back to full fold, and here, plant your hands down, step or jump to plank, hold it, remember, to let your hips drop down, to keep your hips up, you're in a straight line, exhale, knees down, chest and chin to the floor, Elbows always close to your body. Take a deep breath in. Exhale. Cobra. Take a breath here. And on your next exhale, chest back down. Tuck your toes under, come up to your knees. And down dog, hips up. And a stable down dog. One more breath. And as you exhale, lift the right leg up towards the sky. Make sure to keep your hips squared. Don't open your hips to the side. They're right next to each other. Hold it here for a minute. Remember, shoulders away from the ears. Exhale, bend your knee and bring your foot right between your hands. Beautiful. Now your back foot, spin it, put your heel down, make sure the outer edge of your foot is pressed on the floor, your toes are faced forward and towards the left corner of your mat, keep your hands and your hips for now, and bend your right foot if you need, like, if you feel like you need to open your legs a bit wider, do so. Beautiful. Make sure your knee is over the ankle. Now let's focus on the hips. Square your hips right next to each other. Just don't open them to the side, but face forward. Again, make sure your heel is on the floor. Feel that stretch right here in your left hip flexor. So as as deep as you can. When you're ready, arms up, look up towards the sky. Beautiful. Exhale and clasp our hands behind our back. Open the chest up and forward and slowly as you exhale, bring your body in the inside of your right thigh. Humble warrior, and let your hands just drop over your head. Feel that stretch in your shoulders. Hold it. One more breath. And as you exhale, hands down, spin your back foot. It's on its toes now. Right leg back, you're in plank. Hold it for a minute, 
And as you exhale, knees down, chest and chin down, hips down. Hands under your shoulders, take a deep breath in. And as you exhale, cobra. Next exhale, chest down, tuck your toes under, come up to your knees, and from here, down dog. Beautiful work. Take a couple of breaths here, we're loosening the other leg, so get ready. strong and straight, square your hips and hold. Exhale, bend your left knee and bring your left foot between your hands. Beautiful. Now, right foot, spin it. Your heel is on the floor, your toes are turned forward and towards the right corner of your mat. Press the outer edge of your foot on the mat, hips, then move forward, square them, they're right next to each other, and then hips, and bend your left leg. Again, if you need to open your legs, just do so. Make sure your knees are over the ankle. Take your tailbone under slightly, keep your core engaged, hands on your hips, and hold, feel that stretch. In your right hip flexes now. Straight back. Draw the navel in. And when you're happy, hands over your head. Look up. Feel your spine lengthening. Exhale, hands back down. And then clasp them together behind our backs the chest, up and forward, take a deep breath in, and as you exhale, bring your body on the inside of your left thigh, and with your arms, stretch your hands from over your head, handle warrior, beautiful work, and one more breath. As you exhale, hands down, spin your back foot to its toes, left foot back, you're in plank, take a deep breath in, and as you exhale, knees down, chest and chin down, hips down. Take a deep breath in, hands under your shoulders, and as you exhale, cobra, shoulders away from the ears, don't just shrug your shoulders, we don't want to see like this. Open your heart. And then next exhale, chest back down. Take your toes under, come up to your knees, and down dog. Three breaths here. Beautiful work. One last breath. And as you exhale, start walking your feet towards your hands. Your tailbone in a forward fold. And from here, just relax for a second. Cross your elbows. Get your feet closer together. Keep your knees soft and bent. breath. Let go of your hands and come up to standing. Vertebra, vertebra. Amazing. We've got one last vinyasa here. We're going to stay at the top of our mats. Feet together. Take your tailbone under. Squeeze your glutes slightly. Core engaged. Mountain pose. Palms facing forward. Long breath here. Inhale, 
inhale, hands over your head, look up towards the sky, and as you exhale, chair, hips back, make sure you're able to see your toes, your knees are normally forward, and when you're happy, palms together, bring your hands into heart position, we're going to do a little twist here, when you're ready, we're going to bring the right elbow against the outside of our left knee. Use your elbow, push, feel the chest opening to the side. Use your elbow properly. A little twist in your back, middle of your back. One more breath. As you exhale, come back to the middle. Breathe. And your next exhale, left elbow gets the outside of your right knee. Use your hand, push, get into that twist. The chest is turned to the right. Shoulders away from the ears. Last breath. And as you exhale, come back to the middle. Take a deep breath. Exhale. Hands down, forward fold. Knees are soft. Protect your hamstrings. If this is too much, bend your knees even more. Exhale, place your hands on your thighs and as you inhale, half lift, straight leg, straight back. Exhale, forward fold again and from here, step or jump to plank. Exhale, knees down, chest and chin down. Take a deep breath in. Exhale, cobra. Good, and exhale, chest down, tuck your toes under, come up to your knees, and from here, down dog. Three breaths. And your next exhale, we're going to lift our right leg up. We did this before, we're just going to add a couple more warriors there. Bend your right foot, knees, sorry, <laughs> and bring your foot between your hands. Now your back foot, spin it, your heels on the floor, toes are turned forward and towards the left corner of your mat. And your one, again, if you want to open your legs a bit more, feel free to do so. Knee is over the ankle. Square your hips. Take a moment here, feel that stretch in your hip flexors. Beautiful work, and when you're ready, back foot, spin it. Now your toes are turned forward, and the right foot stays as is. The toes are placed towards the um, long side of the mat. Open your hips to the side now, feel that stretch on the inside of your right thigh especially. And again, if you want to open your legs a bit more, if you feel like there's space in your hips, just do so. Keep your hands here, find your balance first. And when you're ready, open your arms, check that they're aligned. When you're happy. Left hand on your left thigh, right arm over your head and reach towards the left. Go over your armpit. If you feel that stretch in your lats, in your obliques. Beautiful. Stay as deep as you can. Shoulders away from the ears. 
and as you exhale, right elbow, forearm, over the right thigh, left hand is extended just over your head, make sure your hand is aligned with your leg in a straight line, shoulders away from the ears, and breathe. more breaths here and as you exhale cart roll your hands down spin your back foot it's on its toes and bring your right foot back plank exhale knees down chest and chin down hips down take a deep breath in hands under the shoulders and as you exhale cobra Exhale, chest back down. Keep your toes under. Come on to your knees and down dog. Find a stable down dog. One more breath. And as you exhale, left leg up, keep it strong and straight, hold it. When you're ready, exhale, bend your left knee and bring your foot between your hands. Beautiful work, spin your back foot, heel is on the floor, your toes can turn forwards and towards the right corner of your mat. Beautiful. Press the outer edge of your foot on the mat. Then when you're happy and ready, focus on your hips. Turn them forwards. They're right next to each other. Place your hands on your hips. And bend your left foot. Open your leg a bit wider if you need to. Stay here. Open the chest. Find your balance. Feel that stretch in your right hip flexors. Beautiful work. And when you're happy, again, choose the position of your right foot. Now the toes are turned to, are turned forwards and the left stays as is towards the long side of your mat. I'm just going to change so you're not looking at my back. <laughs> right here. Feel that stretch on the left thigh. Make sure to open your hips to the side. Beautiful, straight back. Tuck your tailbone under, keep your core engaged. And when you're happy, open your, left, your arms. Check that they're aligned. And when you're happy, right hand on your right thigh, left hand over your head, look up. Inhale, and as you exhale, reach towards the left. Make sure your little lunge here is deep enough. Look over your armpit, feel the stretch in your left obliques, left lats. And as you exhale again, place your left forearm over the left knee, right arm is extended and over your head. Look over your armpit here, make sure your shoulders are away from the ears. Your right hand is aligned with your right leg, straight line. Two more breaths. Roll your hands down, spin the back foot, it's on its toes, and left leg back, your high plank. Exhale, knees down, chest and chin to the floor, hips down. As you inhale, hands under your shoulders, and exhale to cobra. Take a breath here. As you exhale, chest down. Your toes under, 
Do my babies. And down dog. Beautiful work. This is too much. Then we get into child's pose. Bring knees down, hips back towards your heels and rest your forehead on the mat. Just catch your breath. Beautiful work. If you're in child's pose, get back into down dog. If you're in down dog, stay here for one more breath. And as you exhale, walk your hands, walk your feet, sorry, towards your hands. Until they meet in full fold. Keep your knees soft, protect your hamstrings and your back. Close your elbows, let go of your upper body. Just breathe. If you want to rock from side to side, feel free to do so. Go gently to lose your balance. Beautiful, and when you're happy, hands back down, slowly come up to standing, vertebra, vertebra. Beautiful. That was the session today. Thank you so much for joining me. Please remember to cool down. Again, we have a few videos in our channel. Just go check them out, pick one, and then you're done. You're ready to <laughs> move on with your day. Thank you so much, and I will see you guys next time.